Hello everyone and welcome back to Daughters of Ash. Listen here guys, after the previous episode, which was a bit of a disaster to be honest with you, uh, and that's underselling it, you know, I was gonna go back to the previous bonfire on my own, but then I thought, as in on my own, as in off screen, but then I thought Maybe this would be more interesting. Maybe I will die a couple of more times. I won't, uh, but who knows what will happen. At this point, I've lost all kinds of like predictability with this playthrough. I literally don't know what else could possibly happen. Um, yeah, so we got the Pale Ore, which I think relates to the pale servants which are the little demon thing is we're trying to like well basically we're trying to get them to do their jobs uh which is taking us up to an orlando so yeah that's gonna be like the itinerary today it's such a strange word okay Oh, both of you are fucked. Knew it. Um, the other thing I don't know. There's actually a lot of things I don't know yet with this playthrough. Man, that tracking is... I'm sure these guys weren't like this before. Uh, I don't know because, of course, this is an enemy that you kill once. Like It's a non-respawning enemy. And you tend to just like drop down throughout this area and never kind of visit it again but I'm like almost 90% sure that these fools God, you're like I don't know why I'm not even tired but I'm pretty sure that these fools do not track that much with the fireballs originally it's strange coming back through this place Because you like you never do this. Because uh, you always have the Lord vessel. By the time you're here, it's like going backwards through this place is a little bit of a trip. But I think we're gonna hit the place we're trying to go to. And it's pretty close to the bonfire as well. So, oh yeah, of course. Forgot these guys have projectiles. Fuck them. Uh, what we're gonna do is just bust on through. I'm just thinking of whether I should risk it or not. By risking it, I mean coming here. I don't remember there being like. There's a Titanite demon. That's one, not much of a thing. Orb replaced. The paled winged servants can resume their duties at Sen's forge. Naisu, naisu, naisu. Oh, what up? They're just like chilling here now? Ha! <laughs> That's pretty cool. They've become non hostile. Damn. Okay, that's kind of awesome. I'm not gonna lie. I appreciate that. Man, could one of you please drop a humanity? Instead of a firebomb. I have like no use for a firebomb. A humanity on the other hand would be very much appreciated. So like we can just like straight up go to Anor Londo now. Is that what's going on? Because if we can go to Anorlando, the boy will go to Anorlando. Uh, maybe I'm screwing myself by doing that, but... It's like, where else can I go at this point? I feel like Anorlando is the next stage of this relationship. And we gotta go there. Oh yeah, I didn't even say. I finally, I not finally, 
Well, I guess finally. I got a new gaming chair today. I didn't have a gaming chair before. Uh, like a proper... And this is not like an expensive gaming chair, but it is a gaming chair. Like, I'm officially now a gamer. But yeah, I got one. Uh... I was using my old office chair, which you know, I had an opportunity to take home when they were renovating it. So I took that home and... Hold up. Oh, they don't respawn. That's what I've been using, but I'm like, man, I needed something else. Mainly I needed something else to... Fucking hell. Don't ask me why I'm yawning so much. I needed something to play guitar with because the, here's the deal many chairs uh, with armrests are like not guitar slash bass player friendly at all because the issue is if you want to play sitting down uh, like you have nowhere to put your instrument because of the armrest And honestly, chairs with foldable armrests, the one that go the ones that go up, you know, like in an airplane seat, are extremely rare, as I found out searching for this chair. So you know, this one is pretty cheap. Um uh, it's okay quality wise now that I'm sitting on it. But I I don't know how long it will last, but we'll just deal with that, you know, when it comes to it. Oh, fuck. Firekeeper absent cannot light the bonfire. It's because of Lawtrek. Yeah, okay, it's because of Lawtrek. I kind of brought this upon myself because I was like, you know what, I'm not going to kill Lawtrek. So technically this is my fault. Um... Yeah, why not? So yeah, finally, foldable armrests. It's, for some reason, rare. Of course, the other end of it is, like, uh, the next chair up from this one was triple the price of this. And it's like, fuck that, it's still just a chair, you know, that you sit on and you fart on. And so it's like... You know, there's a limit above which I'm not willing to spend. I'm gonna do it. As we get to this bonfire, I will turn back into human form. And actually really try to keep my humanity. I don't think I've broken five minutes since the start of this playthrough, so I'm like really gonna be tryharding this. And we'll see what happens, you know. That second bell thing, though, is still bothering me. That I was... I'm yet... I've yet been able to... Is that even... Does that even make sense? Whatever, it makes sense in my head. Uh, to ring the first bell of awakening. Uh, it's kind of a trip. But hey, the game is letting me progress... Maybe it just leads to some optional shit, you know? Because so far I just knocked into my mic stand. Yeah, I gotta work out the kind of logistics of this chair. Uh, so... There might be slight issues like that. For a little while. I just yawned again. I think it's the weather, like... I don't know what it's been like where you guys are at, but here in Hungary the weather has been like absolutely shit today. This is like the first day that it was mega humid. Like you could feel that it was like super humid and like sweaty outside. It was also one of those days where you know like uh, it's cloudy, but you know those days, those like very cloudy, very humid, 
but somehow you still feel like you need sunglasses and it rained like three times it's just been weird um yeah just weird um okay i was like you better you better load this fucking cutscene cuz damn The boys are coming. I like this quest line though. This is a great idea because it like the game never does explain why these fools are like they help you up to An Orlando and then they try to kill you like a little while later. But now that you got this pale orb which I guess you like returned it to them as a favor. It like makes more sense, I think, that they would help you up to Anolando. I don't know, that's just my idea. Um Anolando is still nice. The city of the gods, yep. I don't remember what I was talking about. Oh yeah, the weather. So that's probably why I'm yawning like a... Oh shit, there's drakes here. Damn. I see you over there. I was just gonna aggro. Yeah, whatever. I'm almost willing to bet money on the fact that this bonfire is not gonna be here. So far there's been like, oh, fuck, you have aggro range. I hate these guys. I always forget I do actually have a plus 10 weapon. To finish my point, that's probably why I'm yawning like an idiot. Oh, it's here. Cool, cool. That's the second bonfire, but no. There she is. Standing like fucking Squall in Final Fantasy VIII. And in, uh, in the kind of dance scene. You know which scene I'm talking about. Look at this. Like, this is definitely the chosen one. Just look at this guy. Looks like fucking Thundercat. <laughs> Alright, cool. Nah, you know what? Let's just... But see, I'm curious. Because they remixed them items pretty well. So I'm like a little bit curious. Oh shit, you're not gonna aggro? Interesting. Oh, there he goes. I was wondering, like, what the hell is going on? Hell yeah. Pyromancy OP. I feel like I'm back on track, boys. We've had a couple of, you know, hiccups. Slight. Oh shit, that is a fucked up hitbox. Cool. That was a waste of a pyromancy, but... In the end, who cares? Magic weapon. That is... 100% useless. See, if I was smart now, I would go back and rest to restock my pyromancies. And you know what? This time I will be smart. Use that galaxy brain. Anyways. Oh, the other thing, I was gonna stream today, I said I would stream from Tuesday, 
on Twitch. Start the Dark Souls 3 strength playthrough, which is what I chose. Um. Okay, I was like, you better be coming up here. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the, yeah, but it's just, I got sidetracked. Like, my schedule's been kind of messed up this week. So far. Well, that's why I had to kind of shift around a uh, couple of days. In terms of, like, streaming and all that. Okay. What the hell? What the hell? Hold on. You boys need to land. Seriously. Don't tell me you've got to fight these guys from the air. Okay, I gotta like... Not miss. Maybe these guys are more like an environmental hazard. Okay, fuck this. Huh, sometimes it just straight up goes through. It's not like I don't have enough arrows, you know. I actually have quite a bit. These guys don't have that much HP. I'm pretty sure that in the actual game like unmodded these guys actually have a fair bit of hp from what i remember listen the job here is to keep my humanity if that means playing it safe then we're gonna play it hella safe so yeah it's just been like that my schedule has been messed up a little bit um, just in terms of not like like not much to go to, not many places, although things are opening back up, which I'm very happy about uh, so we got that to look forward to but still, you know how it is sometimes. I applied for twitch affiliate though. Uh, I think it's gonna take a little bit to get my data reviewed. But after that, we'll be up and running, boys. With that Twitch affiliate. There's quite a few good features. I think the, one of the more significant ones, again, is the fact that you could now... Uh, you're gonna be able to choose the quality of the stream now instead of just having it be set to source which is very good so you know not everybody has equal internet speed that does a lot more damage than I remember so you know being forced to be on 1080p is not always the best Got that shit because I'm sure that's not great magic weapon at this point. Eat shit, bitch. I still hate this section. And I'm not a big fan of heights, which I'm, I think I mention every single time I'm over here. But I'll say it again. I just don't like it. Oh wait, hold on, don't we already have the doll for... Yeah, we do. Yeah, yeah, we do. So I think in theory we should be able to enter the painted world. I'm coming down here because... I guess not. I was almost sure they would put something here. Because this kind of feels a little bit pointless, this area. I mean in the vanilla game.
I guess it's just so that you have a way to get back, right? I cannot believe these flying fools are like the main enemy in this place. Listen, am I stoned or is that meant to play a cutscene? It is, isn't it? The first time you use it, doesn't it play a cutscene? Yeah, whatever. Not gonna lose sleep over that. They took out that cutscene. Listen, there is for sure no bonfire. There is a bonfire here. Okay, it looks like an Orlando bonfires are mostly intact, which I kind of agree with. I feel like the bonfire spacing in this area is it's fairly good. Magic Claymore, Soul of a Rusted Knight. Damn. No seance ring. Man, seeing those words pop up, you are not hollow, was awesome. I don't know how long it's been since I've seen those words. See, now I could go on just like here. Normally. Or we could visit the painted world. Let's go visit the Painted World. I feel like... I feel like there might be some shit there. That was a bad idea. From your boy, I mean. First of all, we gotta check out what's instead of great magic weapon. Imagine if like that's the one item that's unchanged and that's still a great magic weapon. Oh yeah. Think you got them iframes? Painted sword. Sword? <laughs> okay, listen, I, I either just got mega lucky or they made that thing more common. I'm pretty sure that's one of the rarest weapons in the game. No, probably not the rarest, because obviously Channel or Trident is the rarest, it's just a humanity. Damn, that's disappointing. But yeah. Fuck. It's, a, it's, it's not a com common weapon. So I think... What? That was a lag stab. Did you actually see that? I turned around to roll away. And he fucking lag stabbed me out of my... He actually lag stabbed me. Out of my... Roll. Unfair, I think. I feel like half of my deaths so far have been questionable. But it's all good. I'm experienced enough as a Souls player not to take it personally, you know. And so what if I just... There's a lot of these fools here. If I just make a run for it. Well, if this doesn't work, I'm gonna be... Fucked. It does work. Here's some mysterious music being played. Fuck, I'm hollow again. I'm kind of pissed about that. I always felt like that's the noise it should make. That's what it feels like. Cloister of Exiles, Painted World of Ariamis. I can't, I still fucking... 
All right, never mind. Okay, so I'm kind of stuck here, aren't I? Until I get to the end of this. I forgot, yeah, you get... You kind of get stuck in here, don't you? Elite Knight set. Maybe that has the suitable gauntlets to ring the bell or something. Because it says like you need heavy gauntlets and, you know... I don't really think it could get heavier than Elite Knight. Okay, you know what I was trying to do. Oh wait, no, 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 you don't burst the sack straight away. You need to kill him. I ain't gotta sneeze too. <sighs> that was a good sneeze. You know those when you just have like a good sneeze? Holy shit. Velka crows? Okay, looks like they have less of these ball motherfuckers. Ball b motherfuckers. Whoops. I'm fairly sure you can make. Oh, hello, doggo. Shit. Don't worry. Okay, I'm worrying. Slightly worried. And I feel like I just like fucked myself down here because this is a dead end. Are you dead? Thank you. It looks like they don't burst anymore. Yeah, because that was the issue with these guys that they would burst and they spewed toxin everywhere. I think they actually immediately cause toxin on you. I'm fucking sure you can make that. Souls platforming. Fun since 2011. Yeah, 2011, because Demon Souls didn't have jumping. Okay, so I'm either doing really badly, or this is some. It's like pushing me off, though. Because I, I remember there is one of these that like bamboozles you. That you cannot actually jump across. I think it might actually be that one. Whoa, hollows. What the? Okay. Don't worry. I'm an expert at this game. Who's... Oh, I see you. I see where you're shooting from, bitch. Oh, yeah? You think you're gonna get me like that? Okay, he's gonna get me like that. What happens if I'm... Oh, okay. So they only don't burst if you... <laughs> If you kill them with ranged. Yeah, melee is still no bueno. How am I doing on time though? What the fuck? I'm doing okay, I think. As in not okay. Half an hour is up. Shit. Please tell me I have one. I don't have one. I had to use it. I mean, listen, if they give it to you, you, might as well use it for something. This is an item that nobody ever uses. You know, it's like a... It's like a Final Fantasy elixir. Just hoard that shit. Till the end of the game.
Wonder, okay, the dragon is still there. Which of course it would be. So one thing they cannot get rid of. I guess they can't get rid of it because it kind of breaks the area progression for this place. <laughs> okay. So just, he just did that. What? There's no fucking way. Is that Demon Fire Sage? That is your boy, Demon Fire Sage. And of course, these things are still here. With a lot of HP. These things always have this much HP. Um, I was hoping for a bonfire somewhere. But I have a feeling that that's not gonna be happening. See, I thought I could... Oh, gimme, 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 gimme. I thought I could, like... Just casually... Unlock the fog gate. But I feel like that ain't gonna be happening. We're going to the top. At this point... What else can I do for a single humanity? I feel... Did I just see what I thought I saw? Oh no, that's just a... Okay, that's like an actual fire. Not a bomb fire. Huh. I don't like the demon fire sage being there. It fucks with the... What is it? Feng Shui or whatever of this area. What's down here? Hmm. I'm gonna have to wrap it up here though. Cause... We've been going for a long time. I think I might just homeward bone out of here. As in back to the OG bonfire. Although at this point I might be able to walk back as well. Not if this motherfucker poisons me. Anyways, uh, we'll wrap it up here. I'm a little bit not thrown off. The only thing that threw me off is Mr. Fire Sage. So we'll we'll have to like kind of cross that bridge when we get there. For now, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Motherfucker. It didn't kill me. You know what? Just because of that. Fuck you. Yeah, we'll wrap it up here. Thanks for watching and peace out.